Hey, hello there, precious one. I trust God that you are doing well. May the Lord God continue to strengthen you and empower you in the name of Jesus above all things. May you know within your spirit that God says that he will never leave you and not forsake you. Once again, we've gotten this great opportunity coming your way. We pray that you will be blessed so much with this package of encouragement. In the mighty name of Jesus. Shall we quickly pray? Shall we quickly pray? Father, once again, we thank you and we bless you. We honor you in the mighty name of Jesus. Indeed, your word says that you are always there. The Bible says that the name of the Lord is a strong tower and the righteous will run to it and be saved. We thank God we have found sanctuary in you, O Lord. We thank God that we have found safety in you. We thank you, O Lord, that you have given us everything that we may need in life. May your name be exalted. May your name be glorified. We pray and commit everyone out there struggling in any shape or form into your hands. Father, we pray that you will hear their cry in the mighty name of Jesus. We give you praise and we give you glory. We pray that the words that we are about to speak will come with healing, will come with deliverance, will come with safety, will come with guidance in the name of Jesus. We bless you, we honor you in Jesus' name. Amen. God bless you once again for allowing us to come into your houses, your phones, and what have you. Yes, once again, we have another package for you, which we believe by the grace of God is going to bless you so much. Let's quickly go into the word of God. The book of Psalm chapter 17, there are certain things that I believe you want to hear. Hallelujah. It has been so much of blessing for us and I believe it's going to bless you and that of your family in the mighty name of Jesus. Hey, we are serving the living God, a living God, a living. Our God is alive. Our God is powerful. He is gracious. Hallelujah. And most of all, Bible says that he will not leave us and he will not forsake us. We're going to be reading from verse number four. He says that concerning the works of men, Concerning the works of men, child of God, don't worry that much. By the word of your lips, I have kept away from the path of the destroyer. Put your hands together for Jesus. Concerning the works of men, by your word, hallelujah, I have kept my way from the path of the destroyer. Number five, uphold my steps in your path, that my footstep may not slip. I read it again. Uphold my steps. This is a prayer. In your paths, let your steps be guided by the Lord in the mighty name of Jesus. Be assured of this. And I pray for you in this way that your step, Bible said the steps of the righteous is ordered, guided, protected. Hallelujah by the most high God. Uphold my steps in your path that my footsteps may not slip. You will not slip. I say you will not slip according to the word of God. You will not slip. If the Lord God is the one guiding you, you will not slip. Hallelujah. You will not stumble. You will not fall in the name of Jesus. Even when the fall does happen, Bible says yes, that you may fall certain times, but the Lord God will lift you up in the mighty name of Jesus. Don't stay down there. Don't allow the problems keep you there. In the name of Jesus, God is on your side. Be encouraged in the mighty name of Jesus. He says yes, that, that my steps may not slip. Number six, I have called upon you for you will hear me, O God, and incline your ear to me and hear my speech. Look at what it says in number seven. Show your marvelous loving, loving kindness by your right hand. O you who save those who trust in you, from those who rise up against them. Hallelujah. Anything that will lift itself against you, it will not stand. 
Bible says that through the loving kindness of the Lord, he will keep you safe in the mighty name of Jesus. Brother, don't write yourself off. Sister, don't write yourself off. Auntie, don't bring yourself down. In the name of Jesus, the eyes of the Lord is looking on you favorably. In the name of Jesus, and you are positioned so gloriously and strategically to win in every battle. In the name of Jesus, never bring yourself down. He is with you. He says that he is the one that keeps us from the one who who is going to destroy you in the name of Jesus? That reminds me, Bible says that the snare is broken, therefore, we command it to be broken and remain broken in the name of Jesus. Oh boy, let's look into the word again. He says that, Oh, you save those who trust you from those who rise up against them. Is there anything fighting against you? Is there anything lifted up standard against you? The Lord God is going to lift standard against it in the name of Jesus and bring everything down. Don't be downcast in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Bible says that the Lord will keep, will keep you safe from all those who rise against you. And number eight, now listen to this. This is just for you designed purposely for you. Hallelujah. And no one will be able to take it away from you. No one will be able to take it away. He says that number eight, keep me as apple of your eyes. Mighty God. Hallelujah. You are so precious among many. The Lord God is going to keep you as apple of his own eye. What does that mean? It means that he will look on you favorably. Yes, there are many there. It is up to you, hallelujah, to know that the Lord God is on your side in the name of Jesus. And when he does that, he says, hide me under the shadow of your wings in the mighty name of Jesus. And if you go down further, he says that from the wicked who oppress me and from the deadly enemies who surround me, Mighty God, we thank you in the name of Jesus for putting everything in place for us in the name of Jesus. Your people are ready in the name of Jesus in every situation to know that which you have done. Brother, don't give up. Sister, don't give up. These are the words God has put in his word for you. He has placed all of them here in the word of God to keep you going. Don't bring yourself down. Don't condemn yourself. The most important thing that you need to know, he says that he will make you, hallelujah, as an apple of his own eye. No one will be able to touch you. When the enemy comes, he will destroy him. When the enemy attempts, he will fail. In the name of Jesus, what do you need to do? You need to mount up strength, courage, power to know that God is on your side. In the name of Jesus, and claim all the things that he has put in the word of God for you in the name of Jesus. Remember, remember in the midst of it all, conquer every fear. All the threats, all the challenges, stand above them, rise above them, conquer them. Then when you conquer them, you find hope. You will know that God is on your side. Find that hope. And when you find that hope, you will be encouraged. In the name of Jesus, God bless you, God bless you, and God bless you. Hallelujah.